Okay guys, so today we will be unboxing using a freaking chopstick. Let's try this out. I think I'm gonna do my unboxings a little bit different from now on. I'm gonna use everything that I can find that I could possibly use to open boxes. Let's see how this goes. Who says you need a knife for opening boxes? Just go get yourself a chopstick and you'll get your box opened with style. <laughs> oh man, now that's a big container. Why on earth is there substrate in here? No pun intended. You know, substrate, earth, earth, and it's substrate, yeah. My jokes are just, forget what I just said, let's open this. Oh shoot, okay, I better not open this lid right now because I can see the butt over there. And this is an old world, so I better not just play around. Better go get everything prepared and then open this. By the way, this is a Monocentropus belfori, the Socotra Island Blue Baboon. And these guys do appreciate if you give them the ability to burrow. Although a lot of them, I notice, don't really burrow, they just attach web to an anchor point and just start webbing over there but I just decided to provide this guy some amount of substrate just in case he wants to burrow now for this guy the enclosure is gonna be very simple I'm gonna be using a pot as a height now for those that have been following this channel for quite some time you will know that I don't use pots as heights well mainly because I don't really like the looks of them but for this guy I just decided to let's see let's make a change for a bit I'm also gonna be tossing in some leaf litter so if he wants to web around that so what I'm going to be doing is take a hole, put it in like this, then just, just like a normal hide, just cover all around so he can go in and out whenever he wants. Why am I saying he? It's a she. I bought it as a confirmed female. Can you imagine because I'm calling it a he, it turns out to be a mature male. Yeah, that would be the worst thing to happen. Now as always, we pack down the substrate a little bit because they don't like loose, loose substrate, just like that. Now we get the leaf litter and just, I don't know, just put it in. Should I break it? I don't know if that even looks good. I don't really use leaf litter in my enclosures, so I can't judge. Oh yeah, how can I forget the moss, so just... Whoa, I thought that was the tarantula. Made me jump a little bit, so anyways, grab some moss. Sprinkle it down. Man, I think the leaf litter and moss. Why am I like this? Anyways, I think the leaf litter and the moss goes together really well. It looks so naturalistic. I'm really liking this. I'm gonna start doing this in my other enclosures too. I'm not even joking. But let's get this girl. Why do I keep knocking stuff over? As I was saying, let's get this girl into a new enclosure. I hope she doesn't bolt. Where did she go? This is not the way you should ship tarantulas. Don't ship tarantulas like this, guys. Substrate all over the place and surround it in newspaper? Are you serious? You should use paper towels. Don't use newspaper. I don't know why this guy used newspaper. I can't even see where the tea is. Why am I even using my hands? I should not be using my hands. This is a Balfouri. This is such a bad idea, but in a way, a very easy method. Just put it in like this and I'm gonna have to cover guys. I'm sorry. This is an old world. I don't want to get a running Balfouri. There she is. Sorry guys, let me put some light for you. There we go. You can see her right there gorgeous kiwi butt. So now I'm gonna have to... Whoa, calm down. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You see guys, it's a good thing that I put the cover because she straight away ran to here. If I didn't have the cover, she would have... And that will not be fun. Well, fun for you guys, not for me. And I'm gonna carefully open this and take a quick look at her and take out the newspaper. Whoa, chill. I think I'll take out the newspaper from here look at her guys she is ready to whoa whoa okay she can just come out so what am i even doing this is not a good idea why won't you behave please 
Oh man, what a mess. All the tissue. Sorry guys, it looks like I'm not gonna be taking out the lid because she is just ready to roll. Is there a way I can get her down so we can have a good look at her? Okay, she doesn't seem to want to cooperate, so I'll just show you guys her from the sides over here. I know I didn't manage to get all the tissue out. I did get most of them out, but I just don't want to risk my hand with an old world, so I'll get them out another time. It will not harm her, don't worry. But man, why wouldn't she... Okay, wait, she's calmed down a little bit. Get a catch cup just in case. Just gently open this. Hopefully she doesn't run. All right, guys, there she, oh, oh, oh my goodness. Nope, 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 nope. What am I doing with myself? Guys, she just pooped. Did you see that? That's my first time seeing a tarantula poop live. Wow, what? I don't know why I'm so fascinated by tarantula poop, but guys, look at that. It's tarantula poop. If she didn't come out, we wouldn't have seen this. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I guess we will not be taking a good look at her. She is so uncooperative, so Yeah, I think I'll just leave her in her enclosure for now. But guys, tarantula poop. Oh my goodness Okay, let's just take a quick look at her from this angle over here. As you can see, she's one gorgeous looking specimen She has blue legs and like peach colored body or I don't know peach but it's a kiwi butt for sure look at a kiwi fruit butt kiwi fruit you guys like to eat kiwi well <laughs> but I still can't believe that I just tarantula poop oh my gosh and it's not any tarantula poop it's a freaking balfouri poop that's not something you see every day oh man I never thought that I would be so excited to actually see poop legit poop okay guys i'll stop i know some of you guys are eating and yeah we'll stop wait 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 i'm sorry guys i just can't help this <laughs> that is just gross well it's not as gross as normal animal poop not well not like tarantulas are not normal animals but you know what i mean but look at this oh my gosh that is just like little maggots in soup or something okay this is starting to get a very oh my no 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 please no what are you doing this girl is so uncooperative what are you doing come on oh my gosh come on chill i was just looking at your poop i know you're embarrassed but doesn't mean you have to run away get up and stay in there come on behave yourself she is so restless I think I'll just let her settle in well that's what I actually should do allow her to settle in so now you expect me to leave the cup in for you my last time opening this thing just to get my cup please don't run out please stay where you are thank you my gosh behave please what am I gonna do with this poop I feel like keeping it and yeah okay I'll stop guys I'll stop <laughs> <laughs> okay guys, so that will be it for this video. <laughs> if you liked it, be sure to thumbs it up. If you didn't like it, you're also free to thumbs it down. Now if you're new to this channel, be sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell. If you'd like to support through Patreon, there's a link in the description below together with the social media links to Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. So feel free to go check those out. So till next video, you guys take care and yeah, peace.